Talking out of my ass. <clears throat> Number uh, 46. And this is my 46 talking from my shitty fucking anus. The notes. The glorious fucking notes. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Ace Ace versus Jack Deuce. That's the kind of fucking dumbass you deal with at the fucking one two table. In poker. No lemon hole in poker. This fucking shit, shit for brains, right? They had like a white socks cap on. He's talking with the southern drawling shit. Like, uh. I'm in the big blind, you know. I check, right? And this fucking dumbass, two seats to the left of me. He raises the pot, like 25 bucks, right? All the while, I'm holding a pair of aces, right? He raises the pot 25, everybody folds but me. I go all in. Dumbass calls all in. He fucking calls my all in. I turn over my aces, right? He, he, he calls all in. He puts all his chips in. We head to the flop. I turn my my aces over. Dumbass is only here. And he, he turns over his cards. He's only here holding a pair of... Uh, he's holding a Jack Deuce. Not even suited. Like Jack Deuce off suit. And he's saying to me, Oh, man, I thought I would just steal that pot. I mean, yeah, asshole. I mean, you're trying to steal the pot with Jack Deuce and shit. From early position and shit. Fucking retarded people at the fucking one two table. Uh, any small stakes table, just fucking stupid motherfuckers. The only way you're going to beat them is if you had a fucking premium hand. One time I had a pair of queens, right? I go all in. I know this fucking dumbass, right? He raises the pot pre-flop. But I, I had a pair of queens. I go all in with my pair of queens, right? Dumbass calls, right? I turn my cards over, crack my queens. He turns his over, pair of jacks. Stacked his ass. People just go all in with the shittiest of hands, man. They're always trying to bluff you out of the fucking pot at the one-two table. It's infuriating, man. If everybody just play fit or fold, I'd be all right. But no, that's the beauty of no limit. You go all in, you blow people out of their fucking the pot. Buff them out of the pot, buff them out the pot, whatever that idiom is. I mean, these fucking idiots, man. They're just, they're just fucking retarded, man. This dumb motherfucker, man, he had about, I don't know, a whole fucking shitload of chips. At least $300 in chips on the table, right? In his stack, right? I was holding, like, Ace Deuce. I think suited. Ace Deuce suited. Uh, spades. The flop comes. It's like, uh... Four, five spades, and then uh, I don't know, something like two of diamonds or something, or no, like three of diamonds or something. not not three of diamonds, but uh, some crazy, like eight of diamonds or some shit. No, six of diamonds. That's what it was, six of diamonds. So I had the fucking, I had the nut flush draw, and I had a week straight. I think I talked about this last time. This dumbass, he raises pre-flop, you know. I call with my ace too suited. Flop comes, he fucking barrels it again. Continuation bets. I think like 20 bucks, right? I call. He fucking barrels it again. Three bets to pot and shit. I call. He 
fucking turns over. He just says fucking on the, after the fucking the, the river card. He says, okay, no more Ben. <coughs> I checked as well, and then uh, he turns over his fucking card, and he has like a, he had like a six. He, he, he fucking uh, hit his he hit a pair of sixes. He was holding a queen six. He hit a six on the fucking flop. Queen six offsuit. And he's raising the pot with queen six offsuit. Pre-flop. I mean, that, that's just like the kind of dumb motherfuckers you see in that fucking one-two table. They're fucking retarded, man. And somehow they always make their hand. Always. He's like... I don't know. I guess I go on and on. Shit. <sighs> Improv match energy levels. Yeah. Say you're talking to a bitch, right? She's all giddy and happy. You match your energy level. <coughs> you don't. You don't go in all fucking like depressed and shit lethargic like I am right now. You approach her at the same energy level she has. Uh, that's important improv. I don't know why. I guess it's like supporting your partner. It's basically, you know, uh, keeping the scene going. Imagine energy levels. You don't want to contradict your partner in improv, and you don't want to fucking uh, go against their energy. You want to, you know, go with the flow with their energy. It's all for the purpose of continuing the scene. That's what you want to do. I mean, you want to stay in the fucking... You want to stay in that fucking, uh, I don't know keep talking to that bitch for like for until she starts you know spreading her fucking legs you know <coughs> I've been watching a lot of Trump Fucking hair kills me, man. I don't give a shit. <clears throat> I just want him to win just to see what the comedians do with his ass, you know? I'll have a fucking, it'll be like fucking, it'll like be like the fucking, you know, Thanksgiving Day, every fucking day, the jokes, you know? Bad hair jokes, you know. It'll just be like the fucking. It'll be like non stop fucking jokes from the fucking late night talk shows and shit. That's why, that's why I want him to win. I mean, Obama, they really can't do nothing with him. I mean, he's a black guy, he talks like a white guy. It really doesn't, uh. Not many opportunities to you know to sit there and uh, make jokes about Obama, you know. Uh, can't make fun of the way he talks to me. God, I mean, but just the fucking Trump. It'd be like. Just be like a gift basket every fucking day, being laid on your door for the meetings. The jokes that come out. Be better than fucking George Bush Jr., man.
not be doing this podcast and be like, shit. Okay, I'm gonna trudge along. I don't know, the fucking bad beats. Yeah, I got the fucking bad beat. Straight beat by a full house. That'll learn me. I come some professional poker player or some shit. That'll learn you a piece of shit. That'll fucking learn you. Yeah, so, you know, I suffer these bad beats and I just fucking, I stay off the tables for a while after that and get frustrated. I don't know. I'm doing a bunch of other shit now. I'm just reading a bunch of books. Uh, Linux shit. I don't know. Try to write that book, finish that book. I didn't get any donations to finish it, but I was gonna finish it anyways. And I figure if it doesn't sell, hey, at least I'll fucking uh, at least I won't be losing any fucking money. I'll lose my time, but you know, that's somewhat that's somewhat more infinite than my my, my the money I have. I got a lot more time than I do than I do have money. I do money. Oh whatever. Yeah. I'm hoping it doesn't come out like shitty. Story. Bitches.